Hey guys, how's it going? Welcome to my channel. My name's Erica, and this channel is all about cruelty-free stuff. Okay, so I feel like today's video has been a long time coming. To be honest, the other day I filmed a video where I ate a Impossible Whopper. And in that video, I said the line, I would like myself better if I were vegan. And that got me thinking. If I would like myself better if I was vegan, if that's honestly true for me, which it is, why don't I work harder toward that? Why do, why do I not work harder toward that? Why can't I say this? Why do I not work harder toward that goal? And for me, I've just gone to this place, right, where I just feel really comfortable saying, oh, well, I'd really like to go vegan and then never doing it. So I have this really awesome method of being accountable for this, and that's posting the shit on YouTube. I was thinking about that metaphor, like, you know, life's like an uphill battle, right? And if you're not moving forward, you'll start rolling backward, right? You want to keep having progression toward those, like, goals of being the better person that you want to be, right? Um, not that being vegan makes you a better person, right? But like in, for me personally, that coincides with my personal moral co code. So I decided to start this journey with you guys and you guys could join me and do it with me and I'm gonna go vegan, um, hopefully eventually. So I'm gonna start small. My first step toward that is about a week ago, I cut out milk completely. Um, I guess not completely since I'm still eating products that have milk products in them. But I've decided to switch to soy milk. Um, I switched to soy milk even though I know there's that whole thing about how plant estrogen processes in your body um, like human estrogen and your body will just have like a higher level of estrogen basically. I know that that's an issue. I know that's a concern for a lot of people. I'm pretty manly so <laughs> not a huge concern for me. No, I just I don't drink it that much. I basically just put it in my coffee. But I picked soy milk because it's the creamiest of all the milks. There's a lot of milks that I haven't tried, but like I said in that video where I tried the Impossible Whopper, my concern is that I'm going to buy like a $5 thing of milk and then I'm not going to like it. And I'm going to have to throw it away. You know, maybe one day I'll do a video where I try a bunch of milks because I'll have like, you know, an extra little bit of money where I can do that. But right now I'm going to stick with something I know I like, which is soy milk. I do like almond milk. It's just I don't like it that much in coffee because it's not as creamy. If you like different kinds of milk, even if you're not vegan, even if you drink regular milk and you just like other kinds of milk, please comment down below what they are because I would love to try all of the good and figure out like which is the one I like the best, right? So that's my first step, right? <laughs> I haven't quite planned out where I'm gonna go from there, if that's gonna be cutting cheese out or gonna be cutting out like yogurt. So maybe I'll do some fun videos of like price comparisons and like taste tests and stuff like that because I feel like if I have this motivation to also like make a video and stuff, then it'll be a lot more like I'm having somebody to be accountable for. I can kind of make it like a fun thing for me. Um, I just really in the end want to cut out as many animal products as possible. All right, so if you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up. There's that little thumbs up button down there below. Just press it. Press it. Just press it. If you'd like to see more videos of me, press that little subscribe button. And if you want to be notified every time that I upload a new video, you can click the little bell icon. I hope you have a great day, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!